We start at 4 o'clock with flyers with a racial slur found in Longmont late last week. And the Boulder County District Attorney's Office says the culprit should be ashamed of themselves. And while police know who did it, there's really not much they can do about it. Jalisa Irizarry spoke to the DA to find out why. Main Street, Longmont, looks like any other. Shops line the streets, people fill the sidewalks, but an aching feeling fills their hearts. So it's just hard to know that people in the community think that just you existing doesn't matter. Alicia Munoz has lived in Longmont for three years. Late last week, she saw the flyer everyone was talking about. The one, police say, was distributed to a number of downtown businesses and had a racial slur on it. It's a little emotional. Sorry. It's a, it gets a little emotional because I don't want to live in fear, but I also have to be cautious. Longmont police investigated the incident, interviewed the person they believe distributed those 11 flyers and sent the information to the Boulder County DA. Believe me, I would share the community members' reaction to this flyer being absolutely outrageous, and it is, but uh, it's not criminal in nature. District Attorney Michael Doherty says because the flyer didn't target an individual and the suspect didn't trespass or cause any damage to property, the language is constitutionally protected, so no charges were filed. Although the flyers are protected by the First Amendment and by free speech protections, doesn't mean we have to tolerate this conduct. Jeremy Shaver with the Anti-Defamation League agrees with the DA. This is not an instance where charges could be filed. But Shaver says this is an instance that should prompt a conversation. Even if a crime wasn't com committed, there's still an impact to it, right? So that's why it's important for elected officials, public officials, community leaders, neighbors to stand up and say, we will not tolerate hate in whatever form it takes. A stand Munoz hopes more people take. I just really wish that they would do better. As she reflects about Longmont's old Main Street with a new perspective. It's just not something that I really like to have to worry about. Jalisa Rosari, 9 News. The Colorado chapter of the Council on American Islamic Relations condemned the flyers today. In a statement, they said they stand in solidarity with all those targeted by racist intimidation.